Hello all, my name is Elena Arkari and I will be presenting our work on dual stochastic MPC for systems with parametric and structural uncertainty. When systems are affected by uncertainties that can structurally modify their overall dynamics, such as an aircraft actuator failure or suddenly changing road conditions that can lead to skidding, it is beneficial to highlight several operating modes of the system. Typical multi-model based approaches, while taking into account distinct system behaviors, do not enable active learning about the structural uncertainty affecting the system, which becomes crucial for adaptation and recovery, for instance, in these scenarios. The goal of this work is to provide a solution that optimally trades off active learning and control performance, for which the exact solution is given by dual control. We consider nonlinear dynamical systems where M represents the operating mode, phi is a matrix of nonlinear basis functions with associated unknown parameters gamma, for which we assume to know a prior distribution, and the system is subject to additive disturbances W. The objective is to find a policy that simultaneously controls and identifies the system, enabling dual control. So we define the following finite horizon cost, where pi is a policy sequence we want to optimize, n bar is the length of the task, and lk is the stage cost function. The optimal strategy for solving this problem is to apply dynamic programming, which inherently provides the dual effect. The dynamic programming recursion is based on solving the Bellman equation for each time step, given the current information ik that collects all the states and inputs seen up to time k, while updating the distribution of the modes and of the parameters. While this provides the exact solution to the dual control problem, dynamic programming is generally intractable. So for this reason, we provide an approximate reformulation. The problem is solved over a shorter horizon n in a receding horizon fashion and by making use of a rolling horizon approach, which means that dp is applied only over l steps and for the remaining part a suboptimal policy is fixed. This approach, however, still requires to carry out the dp recursion. For this reason, we propose a sampling-based approach, which is exemplified here for the case of L equal to 2. In the dual part, for each mode of the system, we generate samples of the parameters and of the noise from the current distribution. We then update the distribution and repeat the same as before for each visited state. In the exploitation part, we fix the current information and simply propagate forwards until the end of the control horizon. Therefore, the input associated with each subtree is optimized while simultaneously considering future observations and reacting to the corresponding sampled disturbance realizations, which provides dual control. The associated optimization problem is solved by simultaneously optimizing over all the control sequences, overcoming the DP recursion. The following example demonstrates the dual MPC for the problem of controlling an aircraft to a desired altitude. The nominal operating mode of the system follows the linearized longitudinal dynamics of an aircraft, controlled by its elevator angle. We consider the case in which a fault occurs at the actuator, leading to a decrease in gain of 75%. For each mode, nominal and fault, the actuator gain is unknown, but we assume to know some prior probability. The results provided hereafter are averaged over 200 noise realizations, and we provide results for our dual MPC in red compared to a certainty equivalence MPC in blue, where the first dashed line corresponds to when the fault occurs at k equal to 20, and the second dashed line to the reference change at k equal to 60. The dual MPC elevator input explores aggressively as soon as the reference change enters the prediction horizon at k equal to 40, which enables fast identification of a fault, as we can see here, and ensures adequate performance by starting the pitching maneuver early. 
The dual MPC bimodal distribution, defined by the two gains, starts to adapt due to the introduced excitement at k equal to 40 towards the true gain associated with the fault mode, which is active at the reference change. Convergence of the nominal gain slows down as the aircraft approaches the reference, since input excitation decreases, which means that identification is no longer needed. We have presented an approximate dual MPC approach for active learning and control of systems affected by parametric and structural uncertainty. The formulation is based on a scenario tree approach constructed by sampling the noise and the unknown parameters associated to each operating mode of the system. The aircraft control example illustrates faster identification of the active mode and of the unknown parameters while ensuring a smooth maneuver towards the desired altitude.